if it loads. Hello? Hello, welcome to Tales of Thursday. Um, we started just a teensy bit late, uh, just because uh, I think the audio might be a little funky, so let me know if you guys can hear me. Welcome, everybody. Uh, I see some people on YouTube already watching, hanging out. And we're jumping into Tales. This looks easy. Don't get careless. Hello to the Serata on Twitch. That was easy. Game audio is low. Okay, that's good to know. It is blasting in my ears currently. You can't wait to play this game. Well, this game is available um, on basically all major platforms, so you should definitely check it out if you can. I'm going to try to fix the audio for you guys. You said it was too quiet. I can try to fix that. The desktop audio. All right. Then jump in. Very low. Am I low too? Uh, let me know. Okay. All right, we can't even cook. But last time we did defeat a boss, which is great. Alright, let me know if that's better. Um, I'm going to check our synopsis really quick. Back at it like a Thursday. What's up, everybody? Welcome to some people that are uh, returning faces, some new ones. Everyone's welcome. I was a little nervous that it was going to make us fight the boss again because I didn't save or something, so I'm glad that we saved on camera. Hello, Dreekum on uh, YouTube. It's beautiful. This is... Look, Yuri. It's the ocean. Oh, listen to that music. I can see that. The wind feels great. I've seen pictures in books before, but I've never seen it up close like this. Have any of all um, not been like living on the coast and then remember the first time you've seen the ocean? Because it is a very overwhelming kind of experience. Well, people don't usually travel outside the barriers. If we keep going, we can see all sorts of things, like the jungle or the city of waterfalls. There are so many more things we could learn, if only our journey would continue. I guess it's true. I really was living in a small world. Oh. That's a rare moment of sincerity coming from you. It's your first time seeing it too, right? Well, yes, but... Aw, you must have had such a lonely life, tied to your research like that. Carol's asking for it. Having you pity me makes me want to jump off this cliff. Ah, there it is. This water has traversed the world's oceans and has seen all there is to see. Don't worry, uh, God of the Sauce, we are level like 20-something, so I think we're good. The ocean binds the lands of our world together. Here she goes again. It's really just one big puddle, you know. It's a really big puddle, Rita. Whatever. You were pretty moved back there, too. Savage Carol is back. Is that uh, Carol's uh, legacy now? Huh? <gasps> we didn't get bopped on the head. So this is the world as he sees it. Yuri? Flynn must have stood on this spot earlier and looked out at this same scene. That's true. His duties do take him to many different places. Always telling me to catch up with him. Easy for him to say. Nor Harbor is just around the corner from Emmett Hill. We'll catch up to him in no time. <laughs> That's not what I was talking about. Rita the Booper. I like that. Huh? What do you mean? All right, let's get moving before LeBlanc and friends show up again. LeBlanc. Just follow the ocean road to the west after leaving here to get to Nor Harbor. We can't miss it. We'll have plenty more chances to see the ocean. Your journey will continue for as long as you want. 
Sad sigh. It's all up to you. You've made it this far, haven't you? That's true. Last one down's a rotten egg! <laughs> You're gonna fall if you don't watch out. Oh! Oh! Would we just wait, stayed here for forever? Idiot. All right, just appreciate this. Let me sing, sing the song with Titanic. I won't because I'm afraid of DMCA, but just know, just know it's out there for us. Welcome back everybody. Happy Tales of Thursday. Uh, it's good to see everybody. Orange gel. I believe that um, the post that we put out announcing that Tales of Thursday was happening was get some orange gels because I actually ran out last time. Man, could you be any weaker? Let me at him! You would jump into the water? I don't know if, the, if that's a great idea from this cliff height, but it does sound fun. Why is the audio so 3D? This is an HD uh, remaster. Every part of this game is in HD. Guess we can do this. I love the phrase, All right, destructo paint shot. Eight, burn. Eight, burn. Eight, burn. Eight, burn. That was annoying. Alrighty. What's this? Oh, that's a camping set. With this, you can set up camp and sleep without having to go to an inn. <gasps> oh, that's Healing. nice. Now you can go off and play Nature Boy whenever we sleep at an inn. And we'll save money, too. W what are you talking about? Camping sets are single use only. Rita, don't be so mean. <laughs> hmm. That sounds really useful, Carol. Yeah, they're essential when you're on the road. In addition to camping sets, you could also sleep on mats. But camping sets are really the best thing to use. You can't get a better night's sleep with anything else. I feel like he's shilling for it. How much has big camping set paid Carol? What wonderful timing. All of you look so exhausted from climbing. It's a, it's a magical JRPG tent, that's why, uh, totally not named Dan on Twitch. You look pretty pooped yourself. Yeah, we've got a ways to go before we get to town, too. Maybe we should set up camp here. All right, I'll get everything set up. Uh, to answer the question on Facebook, not everything, but it is a very oh, good amount of the Once you camp game. somewhere, you won't be able to camp around there for a while afterwards. Why's that? After camping at a certain site, the basic barrier that's included in the camping set will stop being effective for a while, so long as you're near that site. Oh, there you go. Basic barrier? What's that? There's no Blastia like that. It's not a Blastia, actually. It's just something that gives off a smell that monsters find unpleasant. That's why they call it a barrier. It can keep the monsters at bay for a night. But after enough time passes, the monsters get used to the smell, and it won't keep you safe anymore. I think Carol has, like, a legacy of being stinky. <laughs> I don't know what to do with that information, but it's true. Hmm, that makes sense. Well then, we'll leave the setup to you, Carol. Alright, let's set up a camp a little bit further. Nice, we got a tent. Set up a camp by using a mat. Simple tent, tent, or barrier on the field map to recover HP and TP. The amount of HP or TP recover depends on the item. You will not be able to use an item to set up camp again until after the next battle. Very useful. 
you would pet the doggo. I wonder if the doggo would let you pet him. For Pete is a little feisty. That being said, stay tuned for if you're interested in characters like Rapide, we have something interesting. So I thought I saw a person here. Who's that? Who are you? Guess we can do this. Oh. Uh. Wait, I want to use. Wait, no, not equipment items. What are you? It's just a dude. That's just a dude. Let's beat him up. Destroy him! Not bad! Don't! Holy power, come to me! Hello, Dragon Team on YouTube and Double Bowl on Twitch. How are you doing? Guys just like got him shedding. Holy power, come to me! I thought I was hoping he was like an NPC or something. It's just a dude! Holy power, come to me! Holy power, Holy power, come to me! This? Nah, this isn't scary. Your legs are shaking. You're kidding. Yeah, I am. Hola, how are you doing? Well, that's, what is it, TARDIS? I don't know what time of day it is anymore. But it is. So you're just not a dude either, but I guess I'll fight you. This looks easy. Don't get careless. A thief and a sorceress. Equipment. No, I did this last time, but items. We already know who the thief is. <gasps> who are you? Holy power. Items. Let's try this again. We are going to learn today. <laughs> They're weak to whatever this is. Whatever those attacks are called. Oh, I should really block her. Right, who's next? As your edge! It'll be a hundred years before you, you can beat me. You would pet him if you ripped your hand because off. Because you've lived a lot longer, right? You would pet him exactly. with the hand? Or even if he would rip your hand off? Because I understand that if you would want to take that risk. So I don't recommend it. Oh, I'm glad it's a great and bright sunny day. That sounds lovely. Look at all these monsters. So we are a ways, I think the game did tell us to like take a rest somewhere. Have a nice view of the ocean. Um, is that equipment? I keep doing that. Tent, tent time. Let's do it now. Yeah. I wanna slip. Have a good nap. Looks easy. Don't let him trip you up. Well, that guy really no just way you could did win. not have a great time. <laughs> Look, we got a good night's sleep, and now we're all rested. Repeat learned a skill, and he's not even in my team right now. Oh man. All right, all right. Destroy her! Oh, come to me! Hey. Fair. Yeah, I would love to coordinate this where we would actually play with separate people. But unfortunately, I'm playing by myself. We got bread. Did you guys see we got bread? There's opportunity to somehow make a sandwich. Just maybe. I think I could still go down there, huh? 
Man, could you be any weaker? Let me at him! Drag it over! No, we don't have all the material for sandwiches yet. Also, welcome back to Rob Yuki. I recognize your username. Thank you for coming by. Alright, I think we were supposed to go down there. That seems like an area to visit. Aww. Sorry if I hurt you. <laughs> This? No, this isn't scary. Your legs are shaking. Fun, fun. Yeah, we've gotten to a little bit of a groove for Tales of. <gasps> Wait, suddenly it's all dark and stormy? We just had a lovely day outside. Let's put a plot. The mood. Man, the weather sure changed in a hurry. No, oh, they even acknowledge it. Let's find an inn before we get soaked. Estelle, what is it? Oh, I... I just thought a harbor town would be more... lively than this. Yeah, this isn't exactly how I imagined it either. But it feels like the kind of place that Corsip you're looking for would hang out. Dedeki was headed for Torum Harbor. I'm sure the two are pretty similar. No way. It's only Nor Harbor that's scummy like this. Uh, what do you mean? Nor Harbor is... It's I all because of the Empire. What would to that little brat if you didn't have our money? Please, sir. Not that. Please give me back my son. Oh, no. With this awful weather the last few months, we haven't been able to launch the boats. Surely you realize, sir, we can't hope to pay our taxes like this. You'd better hurry up and capture that Ribgoro beast, then, shouldn't you? What kind of... That's right. If you sell his horn, you'll never have to worry about taxes again. How many times do we have to tell you? Savages. Is that the sort of scum you were talking about, Carol? Yeah, the Empire's influence is really strong here. I heard things got even worse with the new magistrate. He's some Imperial big shot who does whatever he wants. That's not anything we'd like to hear. Which means there's no one to complain to if his henchmen act like that. <sighs> but how can that Yuri. be? That's enough! You're hurt! You might even get yourself killed this time! But it's our son! If I don't go... You see, his name was Teagle. Ah! What are you trying to do? Oh, sorry about that. I didn't see you there. Yuri! My apologies, sir. Let me take care of that. <gasps> but I... I can't afford this treatment. Teagle and Kellus. Do you like how these NPCs have names and they haven't told us them yet? Don't you have something else to say? Huh? Jeez, you guys been robbed of your manners along with your money? Uh, I'm sorry. Thank you most kindly. Hmm? <gasps> we saw a shadow of a man. Or a woman, I don't really know. Look at Carol's smile. Look at that little sunshine huh? smile. Yuri? Oh, I'm glad that you're, uh, came by to watch, Chris. Repeat. Okay, so I don't think we're supposed to be part of this conversation. Oh. We're suffering because of the console. Hey, Yuri, don't wander too far and get yourself lost. Okay, thanks, Carol. Empire stands just too love to appoint someone like him. I had no idea this was happening in Kaplamor. 
Okay. Let go. They're not in business because they can't. Here's market. This is the most menacing market I've ever been to. Yeah, thank you, CP, uh, for interjecting a lot of places to check out this game. Ooh, a morning star. I have to get that for Estelle. I want to see her carry that around. That's so funny. Alright, this is for later. Hmm. Look at all the stuff I can buy. Shopping. There's a little doggy jacket, guys. There's a little doggy jacket. Ah! <laughs> Thank you. Whoops. Got a text. Gonna mute that. <gasps> we can cook. We can cook. <laughs> I wasn't expecting it to be in this like super dark, menacing place, but we can cook. I actually have to look up what the uh, what the recipe is for stuff. But in the meantime, let's get some salmon. Um, taxes are high, and so it's not even profitable. That's real sad. <laughs> Guys, we can make a rice ball. We can make a rice ball. If you're new to the stream, I'm really into making everybody cook. I think it's funny. Alright, time to go down this dangerous alley by myself. Tears flesh and cuts bone? Let's call it Morning Star. Let's get this over with. Hmm. Why did we go off by ourselves? Oops. Jeez. This isn't gonna go well. Slice, slice. I'll blow you away. Get out of here. We'll strike. As your edge. As your edge. Slice. Really isn't fun for me. Can I use an? an let me run. Wow, am I gonna die to these random guys in an alley? Oh my goodness. Wait, I didn't even save. This is gonna be fun. This is what I get for not paying attention. And they were never heard from again. Oh goodness. All right, we're gonna we're gonna speed run Trek back there. It's good to know. It's not like I couldn't have fought him. I think I just was confused as to why they kept on yelling. Cut. Don't get careless. Ah, uh, it's okay, guys. Thank you for the F, CP. I know, I forgot which button was the free run until it was too late, and I apologize. I gotta try and keep up. So, just for, for reference, I know which button the free run is. It'll be a hundred years before you can beat me. Because you've lived a Oddly fitting, though, that um, we successfully beat the boss like the second time around but then died to the the random dudes in an alley that we went off to try to fight by ourselves. Can I not? Okay. I'm gonna make you work. Yeah, I beat you into next week. Next week? Hi, but Yuri. Welcome you back. Really? How are you doing? Never mind. I feel like it is a bit loud on my end, but I can just lower that. Okay.
something something ocean lovely all right let's go uh we are doing well we're on our fifth stream of tales of vesperia and i happened to die in the middle of the story event because i wasn't paying attention um and i don't think the game expects you to die there or the it's not like the most challenging so there was not a save point anywhere near it just go away Yep. And now I remember which button to free run. It was all learning lessons. I think I also was caught off guard by if you were approached by a guy, a creepy guy in an alley, and he took out a knife and he's like every time. Would you really would you really be on your You want revenge? Guard? Bring it! <laughs> of course, I just had a box cutter here. What's this? All right, we already learned what tents are. Oh, this is the overworld one. Really. I don't really feel like fighting these guys, because we did in another timeline. Those people are on something and I don't know what it would be. Yeah, that seems about right. You won't lose! Five count. Oh, I don't know what <laughs> Carol just completely whipped that attack. Repeat, that was awesome! Repeat, that was wonderful! Oh. We could act a little shy. more grateful, you know. Alright. The things look like radishes, which means they are delicious. beaten this game three times now? I mean, I totally understand it. It's a lot of fun. Alright, we already watched this. It's all dark. We have parted with everyone. Alright, let's buy stuff at the shop. I do think that this morning star is good luck whether or not we are actively using it. I have to buy the little puppy jacket. I have like no money when I leave this, but you know, it's okay. Cause I'm gonna be able to cook. That's what matters. Salmon. Dried seaweed. Alright. Could you please buy more? I'm sad. Um. Oh, what is the ingredients for a rice ball? I need four rice and one dry seaweed. Okay. I'm coming back to buy more, don't worry. Oh, I didn't have any dried seaweed. Alright. Alright. Cooking, cooking, cooking. Oh, we failed! <laughs> we failed to make the rice ball. Again. What? We're full, even though we failed to make it. 
So you beat this fairy and you're about to beat Symphonio. What's the next Tales game you should pick up? That's a good question. Does anyone in chat have a favorite that they would like to recommend? I feel like because none of the Tales games are really connected in that way, you can pick whatever you would like. Let's see. What can I give? Oh, wait. I don't have any... Did I not pick up the orange gel that was just on the beach there? It's okay. I can just buy some. You're doing the 100 man coliseum right now. Yeah, Berseria? That's definitely, I love um, that game. The designs are so cool too. Yeah, let's just full health for good measure. This is what everyone came here for, right? Equipment management. Ooh, this is nice and slow. Long sword. Hmm. We have a better attack, but do we want to be less? Do we want to be slower and less defense? Let's try it out for a little bit. That was a good idea earlier when we were fighting the poison thing. Attack ring. Raise the attack 10% during battle. Sounds pretty intense. Might use that. Alright. Bye, Christmas. Have a good night. Thank you for watching. Alright. I can't. If I save here, it's a quick save, huh? Or there's not even a save. Okay. So we just gotta not jack it up. <laughs> Dice Master's house. Oh boy, look at all this stuff that we haven't. that we should probably not do right now. There's a dog. Can I pet you? Can I pet you? I hope you have a good day, dog. Hi, Beryllium Coffee. Welcome back. How are you doing? It'd be cool to see Eternity or Destiny. I believe that we're going to try to do Tales of Thursdays in, I want to say, like, reverse release order, where because Vesperia was most recently uh, remastered, we played it first. So I think we're going to try to tackle Presteria first, or next, rather. But um, I'll let you know. We're... Wanted fugitives at large. Man dressed in black with front buttons open. Male, long black hair. If seen, contact the Imperial Knights at once. Is that us? I'm handsome. They didn't put that in the listing. So, how are we supposed to know? Alright, I'm just completely ignoring that guy now. Alright. Oh, yeah, that's right. So, CP just dropped a link in the chat um, for repeat. Actually, I know that you guys are like, why don't you just fight the, the dudes in the alley yet? Um, but I think, I think we're going to pause this for just a second. Maybe I should... Or here. Let's just fight the guys again so we can hopefully get less depressing music. And then I will show off our super cool live stream um, exclusive. I thought Yuri's hair is purple. It's like a very dark purple, I would say. It's like stylized black. Let's get this over with. Yay, free running, guys. Remember that? Cut. Oh, that's so fun. <laughs> Oh. Still not a fan. Still not a fan. My guy. Goodness gracious. Hello? Hello? It's not over yet. There we go. That wasn't as bad, was it? If you're a wanted fugitive, there's no harm in murdering these crooks. 
Hey, I mean, they started it. I mean, I might have followed them into a creepy back alley, but they're the ones that started going slice, slice, slice. So I'll take it. Thank you, thank you. Yuri, are you all right? <laughs> Flynn, what are you? Hey, that's my line. Yay! Also, look at this dude just watching, waiting. It's hit in all caps. I've been looking all over for you. That one was mine I too. To Whole time, I just wanted to give you a big old hug. Him. <laughs> All the crates. Huh. That was about to get ugly. All right. Whoa, hold on. What are you doing? Yuri, I'm happy to see you're finally seeing the world outside the barrier. What's happening? So, be a little more happy then. Stop pointing that thing at me. Well, I got a little less happy when I saw this. Hey, it's up to 10,000 gold. Nice. Nice. I didn't think when you quit the knights that you'd take up a life of crime. Yeah! I forgot how good the, the wanted poster is. A lot of things so have beautiful. happened, Flynn. It's not that simple. Simple or not, a crime is a crime. Good to see you're as stubborn as always. I... Uh-oh. Yuri, I heard something happened. Are you all... Perfect timing. Flynn! Huh? Oh, like... Flynn, are you all right? Have you been hurt? That smug little smile. Uh, I I'm fine. Um, lady... Oh, I'm sorry. I, I was just so happy to see you. I... Please. This way. What? Uh, but Flynn, there's something I need to tell you. I better go find Carol and Rita. I, I need to give her the Morning Star. She better not leave my party yet. Yeah, we have a bigger bounty on us. Okay. Um, so the music continues to be depressing. That's not really what I was hoping for. But. I do want to show off our very cool live stream I told you for this, uh, week. Anyway, try to be super careful with it. But we have a very gorgeous repeat figurine that's up for sale. And I can try to do an unboxing on stream. I d only have this camera space. I didn't set up one so that I can set see the whole camera. Here's the, the fancy sleeve, that's the outside. That is the struggle of JRPGs. You just try to give everyone cool weapons and then they disappear from your party for a little bit. And you're like, wait, come back. I want that sword. Okay, this is unboxing. Hello. He's all safely packaged up in here. I'm trying to make sure. I can see I have some styrofoam, very secure styrofoam packing. Uh, I have cut it open beforehand just so I wouldn't have to do it on stream. <laughs> but I might have made this a little difficult for myself, so we'll find out. It is a very epic unboxing. It's like an auditory experience. I was hoping for more uplifting music, but we'll see what we can get. I feel like while you guys are watching me struggle with this box would be a great time to do. 
do some like stand up comedy type vibe. I don't have anything like that prepared though. Yeah, I accidentally. Oh, I can lift the white box. <laughs> I just got news from our um from our support, our lovely people from the store, the stores uh, that we can lift this, but. We're good! <laughs> Alright. Still in the very precious plastic wrap, and all of it is repeated in a very protected form of glory. And just unveil this to the world. This music is the sound of me having no money. That is relatable. Uh, but that being said, you can get this amazingly high quality, hand painted repeat figure for like the lowest price it's ever been. So even if you got no money, he got money for a repeat. Look at that face. Can you say no to that good doggo with his tail still protected by styrofoam? His pipe is uh, over here. You still have to actually attach it manually. Here it is. Your tiny little pipe. It has like the care and precision. Have a great um, rest of your day. Thank you for coming by to watch during your lunch break. All right. I don't know if I'm going to take him all the way out of the box, but this, this repeat right here, well, not this one exactly, but he could be yours. And he's a good friend. Also a very good hefty weight to it. Just yeet. I wouldn't recommend yeeting the repeat. Just to do some massive damage. All right, gonna carefully place the little repeat protection back on, uh, but I will leave this out here and occasionally bring it back up during the stream. So if you guys would ever like to see repeat, uh, if there's like a moment that needs a little bit of a break or whatnot, let me know, I'll pull him out. We can all appreciate him together. Back to the game. What's this game called? This game is called Tales of Asperia. This is the definitive edition, and it came out just a little bit ago, so we are playing through it right now. I do not remember which direction they headed. His tummy hurts. Welcome to the port. Kapua is divided into Noor to the south and Torm to the north. This is the south side, Kapua Noor. Magistrates in this, civil, in this city are evil. Not only do they take taxes from the citizens, they also make travelers pay. As, here's an inn. Can I save? Some guy just dragged Estelle right by us. Are they both inside the inn? Yep. So that other guy was Flynn then. Yeah, well. You How might not Billy be able to get a Manny? word in edgewise if you went in now. That's pretty funny. Seemed like they might be in there a while. Want to burn time walking around town a bit? Sure, okay. We can't. I would love to save. Okay. Maybe we should come back later. All right. Let's come back later. Welcome, or so I'd like to be able to say, the Trino liner service is not operating right now. The magistrate said he'll sink any ship that's heads out. Can you believe that? Wow. My apologies, the entire wharf is closed off by the magistrate's orders. I'm afraid I don't know when it will be open. Cooking! Yes, you found me! You're pretty good. I'll teach you to cook as a reward. Wonder Chef, I don't know if this is the best place for this. We learned how to make a sorbet. I'll give you this so you can practice. Obtain three sets of ingredients for the recipe. Time to meet a certain pirate. Very certain special pirate. Bye everyone! Have a great day, uh, Grim Reaper. I want to pet this cat. Be my friend. Okay. 
Late night sorbet gray sounds good right now. Oh yeah, that does. Uh, this morning I tried to make like a, you know, like they make like acai bowls or fruit bowls. Uh, I made one last night or as a smoothie. I put it in a bowl and I stuck it in the freezer and then it was frozen solid. So that was my breakfast. It's just essentially a popsicle. Me. What the hell is a brat like you doing trying to get in here? Aw, don't throw a hissy fit. Have a bite of this and calm down. I love her. Get that out of my face. This isn't the kind of place for kids. Yeah, I mean, the, the cat had a nice little stanchion. A little blockade. Celebrity cat. Oh. Yeet. We have received the child. Mmm. That sure is a rough way to treat a child. Who the hell are you? That brat's daddy or something? Oh my god. I'm like 20-something. Seriously? Do I look like the parent of a kid this big? Time to try again. Break me off a piece of that Kit Kat bar. <laughs> Oops! Hey, hey. You really think it's okay to point a weapon at an unarmed child? I'm just teaching the brat a lesson about the consequences of breaking adult rules. Just cut it out, okay? Yeah. What? What are you doing? <coughs> now you've gone and done it. Stabbing allowed. <laughs> Hold up, you, you've come this far and now you're just gonna run away? You need to be prepared if you're going to grab a beautiful young lass's hand. Prepared? Prepared for what? Sorry, now ain't the time. Uh, what? Look at that smug little face. Farewell! Bye! You brat! Get back here! Damn it. The hell was up with that kid? Hey, buddy. You better get lost, too. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> oh, I forgot about the little face. Well, I guess Flynn and Estelle should be done talking by now. We got a little cast off though. Surprisingly detailed. What a waste of talent. All right. We just had to get a glimpse of one of the best girls in this game. But I say that, but every single girl in this party is best girl. No, it. Here's the thing: is that it's way more fun to just try to jump with the narrative and pretend that that's what we're what we're actually thinking than, you know, spoiling the whole thing. Alright. Yeah, we are. Sal, come back! I got you a morning star. Got you a gift. Let's save the game first before you... I guess the Empire likes to throw its weight around no matter where you go. Before I left the capital, I didn't know or care about anything besides the lower quarter. <laughs> it's not everywhere, but I feel like the Empire's influence is especially strong on Alikia. They can do whatever they want since there aren't any major guilds on Alikia. We can't just let it stay this way. <laughs> I'm sorry, Beryllium Coffee. I can only shell for one piece of uh, merchandise per stream, but... That is, that's a good idea. I will try to pass that along. I'll tell you, this is one mean world. Huh, I guess it's not much of a welcome. Anyway, want to stay? 300 gold a night. Yeah, we have money. Oh, have you ever played this game before? We'll find out. Haha, -ha, let's take it easy, huh? Life is short. It should be spent in comfort. I'm not scared of the magistrate. I'm a noble. It's my magistrate voice. Er, noble voice. Man. Seeing it doesn't matter how much money I have, no ships are leaving, that's that. I've made my peace with it. Without experiences like this, it's impossible to find out how the common folk live. Traveling as I normally do, I'd never have the chance at such an important experience. People that, like, go off and volunteer once and think that they're god. <laughs> Not been able to go out to sea due to bad weather. Want to hurry back to my hometown, but held back for various reasons. Local magistrate by the name of Ragu. Probably not the pasta, though. 
charge a large sum for passage. Can't afford to risk it, not knowing what the weather will be like in the next town. Plus, who has that kind of cash? Hope the weather improves tomorrow. Locked. Check every door. All finished? And are we done whispering secrets? <laughs> I like you come in. They're like, I, I think that Yuri's kind of cool, but I don't want to tell him because then it's going to go to his head. Like they're just all whispering like good things about each other. I've heard your story up until this point, Yuri, and also the reason for the bounty on your head. First off, I owe you my thanks for protecting her. You say it like she's not right next to you. Oh, I've been meaning to express my gratitude as well, Yuri. It's nothing. I was already out searching for that Blastia thief. And that's where we have a problem. Hmm? Regardless of the circumstances, the Imperial law cannot allow the obstruction of officers, jailbreaking, and trespassing. Really? You're gonna harp on me for breaking out of jail? I'm sorry. I'm afraid I told him everything. Don't be sorry. I mean, I did all that stuff. Then I assume you are prepared to receive the punishment your actions deserve. Yeah, bye. <laughs> Yuri, I'm glad that you g you're going to try it out now. You get to meet your namesake. In Flynn! Do whatever you like, but just listen a minute, will you? So you can tell me how it was all done in order to get back the lower quarters Blastia Corps? That's what you wanted to say, right? Sir Flynn, I have news! What is Rita doing here? <laughs> Sir Flynn! Excuse me? I heard you refused an Imperial request for assistance. Do you think it's all right for a mage employed by the Empire to simply abandon her obligations? Man, everyone's got issues with us. Who's that? Got me. <laughs> huh, whatever. It's not like I care a whit about you either. The classes. I'll make the introductions. This is my second in command, Sodia. This is Witcher, a mage who offered his assistance to us at the laboratory in Ospio. The name is kind of on the nose, don't you think? Anyway. This is my... You! Sir, it's the criminal from the Wanted poster! At ease, Sodia. He is a friend of mine. What? But sir, he's a wanted man! Whatever. I've just heard his story. While he is guilty of minor crimes, the warrant for his arrest contains false accusations. Thank you. Later, I will return him to the capital and explain the situation. And he will receive his due punishment. Hello, Sunflower. How are you doing today? My... my mistake, sir. Witcher, let's have your report. Everyone's standing all tall. So we're done here, right? Um, I'm gonna try to work I believe the thing. ongoing rain and wind are being caused by a Blastia. The weather in this season is unpredictable, but this does not explain why it worsens whenever boats leave port. We also have testimony that something like a Blastia was carried into Magistrate Rago's residence. It's Rago, not Ragu. That makes more sense. I've never heard anything about a Blastia that controlled the weather. That's, I'm doing well, thank you for asking. We are playing Tales of Vesperia, Definitive Edition. This is our fifth time around the block. Nothing like that has ever been excavated. Wait, the Aquiblastia, the ruins, it couldn't be. So his lordship, the Magistrate, is using a Blastia to control the weather. It appears that way, though we can't yet say for certain. Really? Seems pretty obvious. The harbor has been closed due to weather. Any ship that leaves is fired on for disobeying the ordinance. So much for crossing over to Torum. Those aren't the only rumors surrounding the Magistrate. He's released a monster known as Ribgaro into the wild, and amuses himself by forcing those who can't pay their taxes to hunt it. We just let him do that? He claims he'll pardon their taxes if they can manage to capture the beast. How cruel! That injured couple we met near the entrance must be two of his victims. And their child! <laughs> the Lord is just protecting the city from drought. Yeah, we need an Aquablastia over, like, South California. What? What happened to their child? Forget about it. 
Well, it's been a hell of a day for us, and we're tired. Let's just stay at this inn for the night. I already paid the 300 gold. Also, we can't forget about a certain missing person. Missing person? It's you, Estelle. Uh, I'm currently playing this on PC via Steam, and I'm using an Xbox controller. Oh, still hasn't joined our team yet. Can I go back in? Still, I just want to give you this morning star, so then you can be on your own. Still, what did what you did? Who would have thought someone with a 10,000 gold bounty on his head would be a friend of Flynn? And Sir Flynn, too. Turning out an Imperial request to run around with these people. Is she trying to ruin Ospiel's reputation? Whatever. No, there's nothing inside. Let's put it back. That's nice. We're good people. since yesterday. Oh, Poor tummy. Flynn just wants the money. So I think he just is a little too uppity about justice. So what's the plan? I'm gonna go see Magistrate Rago. Really, Estelle? What? We'll get turned away at the gate if we try to go there. Even a noble woman like you would have no chance of getting in. Yeah, but with the harbor barricaded, we can't cross over to Torum Harbor. And that thief Tadeki, along with that one-eyed giant, are both on the other side of the water. Let's stop blabbing about it and just go, why don't we? If you won't listen to what we have to say, we can think of another plan. All right. Let's head to Rago's palace, then. Yay! Okay. I'm equipping this before I forget, guys. This is very important for me. Yeah! Look at that. Awesome. No matter how you slice it, Flynn is Flynn. He's even more stubborn than before. <laughs> you think so too, Repeat? <laughs> well, at least he seemed to be doing all right. Estelle's way of doing things. Let's talk to him. Yuri's way of... Uh, Yuri's plan is just crime. <laughs> What did you miss? You had to go eat dinner? Well, I hope you had a good dinner. We are going to try to talk to the magistrate in charge of the land. The city? Um, this area, the harbor. Uh, we're about an hour in. I do want everyone to say hi to Sam, who is also part of uh, modding our chat today, along with CP. Everyone, everyone can just say hi. What do you want? You had pizza. I love pizza. I'd like to meet with <laughs> Magistrate Rago if you'd be so kind. Yuri, these men are mercenaries. I wonder what guild they're from. Not really being very quiet, Carol. I guess that explains the thuggish look. <laughs> Go home, Scram! The Magistrate is a busy man. Surely not too busy to rough up the people in this town. Mm. Hey! You better watch your mouth, punk! Do we really have to? Do we? We're the main characters. See? I told you he wouldn't see us. Let's get out of here before things get sticky. I'd have to agree with Captain Carroll on this one. But there must be some other way. Forget it. Let's go. We'd best leave the frontal assault on the palace to the Imperial Knights. But isn't the fact that that's going so badly precisely what's got Flynn in such a bad mood? <laughs> Maybe he'd see us if we came bearing gifts, so to speak. A gift? What do you mean? The Rib Guru. It's worth a fair the amount of money, right? Come to think of it, that official mentioned the Rib Guru. He said that someone with its horn would never have to worry about taxes again. If we brought something that valuable, the Magistrate would at least grant us an audience. 
You propose to catch the rib grow? Fight, 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 fight. This is our chance. It's raining after all. What does rain have to do with it? The rib grow comes out of hiding when it's raining. Is that why it's been raining for so long? Out of all the monsters I know, it's the only one that goes out in the rain. Capital observation, Captain Carroll. What else? Fight, what do you fight, mean, fight. what else? Kiss, kiss, kiss. That's all there Thank is you. to it. Thank you, Chad. So where's the rib girl now? Uh, just as I thought. Well then, let's go talk to the people in town and get their side of the story. Are you okay with this, Estelle? Yes, Yuri. If we're unlucky, this could put all of us on the wrong side of the law. The one who makes the laws in this town is his lordship, the Empire's magistrate. You be okay with defying him? I'm going with you. Break the law. Break the law. You're okay <laughs> That's really with it what this then? Is. Yes. Rita, you don't have any problems with it? I have to say, I'm incredibly interested in a Blastia that can control the weather. Then it's decided. So then, let's seek out the Ribgaro first. I love the word Ribgaro. Break the law. Break the law. Please do not take things that I say on this stream out of context in terms of uh, choosing to act on them, unless you're playing a video game. In that case, go nuts. Let's do crime. I'm just saying that things will go a lot smoother if we beat up Flynn. We can't though, he's too handsome. The cat's not even looking at us anymore. We'll have a time of day. The horns with yellow skin are more expensive. I think the yellow ones I saw are more expensive. Okay. Yay, crimes! I was gonna break the law, but now that you said it, or now that you said not to. See, it's the uh, JRPG laws. Like, once you say not to do something, they'll do it. That's your problem. Okay. So everyone around town is now going to give us advice on how to find this thing. Oh, I already clicked that. Bye, ma'am. I'm gonna save one more time. Flynn's a precious boy. Never hurt precious boy. You never could sit still, could you? Stop treating me like a little kid. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that kind of attitude all of a sudden. Yuri, don't do anything reckless. I haven't done anything reckless since the day I was born. I'm just chasing after a Blastia thief. Yuri. You're the one who should ease up on trying to do the impossible, Flynn. Witcher, go and see if we can get the right to search Blastia Laboratories. <sighs> I thought leaving the capital would have changed him a little, but it seems like he's even more reckless than before. Flynn? Yuri's so single-minded when it comes to protecting others. He's willing to sacrifice himself to do it. He says that like it's a bad thing. Aren't you supposed to be a knight? I envy him for that. But I also worry that he'll take it too far. Medieval cop. Come on, Estelle. Let's go. Yuri's gonna leave us behind. Right. We should be going now. Mr. Steel, your oh, girl. Oh, by the way, Lady Estelise. Yes? How... How is it, walking around outside, free? I can't say everything's been perfect, but... I realize that there are things I must do. And that makes me happy. It's been wonderful. Good. I'm glad to hear it. Oh, nice. Hi, Dale. How are you doing? Hope your day has been going well. Hey, Rita. What did Flynn mean about search and seizure rights to Blastia Laboratories? Oh, that. Basically, if you're on an official Imperial Blastia investigation, you can go anywhere you want. Are you serious? Why bust our butts when the knights can do that? I don't think they can. 
There are plenty of exceptions that can block their authority. That sounds like what I've come to expect from the Empire. Alright, guys. Um, oh, I like how this, this thief is just slowly approaching us. Oh. I'm going to pause this for a moment. The music's happier. I'm going to try to... To un... Unleash? Unwrap? To show off, um... Our lovely little repeat again. Just want you guys to not forget this cute little... Puppy face. Good old doggo. Hey, actually get out the pipe. Um, and yes, I was tinkering it with our, um people working behind the scenes, but we are going to have a giveaway of one of these repeat stakers. Not only are they only $40 right now, uh, I believe that's the price. If I'm wrong, please let me know. Or if it's $40 off. Um, but if that's the case, um, definitely check it out. That is the lowest price it has ever been. I'm, I'm slowly adding the little pipe. So at the end of the stream, we'll be doing a giveaway for repeat. Um, for, so this will be restricted to North... I think it's US only. So United States and Canada are going to be allowed to be in the running for this giveaway. Here you go. Got that sweet pipe. Look at, look at this repeat in the eyes and tell me you don't want to be his friend. Hi Chloe, how are you doing? Yeah, giveaway hype. We haven't done one in like a week or so, so wanted to give back. Thank you guys for coming by and watching the stream. Um, if you're excited or would like to try to get your hands on uh, one of our free giveaway versions of Repeat, then let your friends know and maybe they can help your odds. Hype, hype, hype. Okay, yeah. I'm like very gingerly placing things away in the meantime. But while the music was hype, we're in a fun, jaunty little journey. I wanted to show you guys just how cool this repeat is. <laughs> Back to the game. Well, I'm glad that you came by to watch the stream right after work. Welcome. How do you win that? Um, Stick around in the stream as long as you're here at the end, you'll Just be in the go running. Away. And the same rules as usual. Just oh, the hang out in chat. Be chill. <laughs> Look at Estelle and her morning star. It's all I ever wanted. <laughs> Put out your hand. Like I'm this? Sorry. Yay. Hi, what, what was that? The repeat way is going to carry you away. All right, rice ball, rice ball. Rice ball success. Okay. Unfortunately, this game is not available on any mobile devices, except for unless you're counting the Nintendo Switch. So it's on uh, PS4, Xbox, Nintendo Switch, as well as uh, Steam. It still never looked so menacing until you saw the morning star in her hand. That's all I wanted. Guess we can do this. <laughs> Let me say, if you are interested in Tales, I do think there is a Tales mobile game. It's definitely not the same story as this one, but it is pretty dang cool by itself. Check out Sam. We performed marvelously! I think you should add repeat back to the party. Yeah, I should. Alright. I, I have to do what the people ask. How do we do this? Is it status? There it is. Dog night. 
Right, we have to get repeat his little doggy armor too. Alright, sorry Carol. You're off the team. Even a best boy. What are we looking for? We're looking for the the monster, right? Is there a specific place that we're supposed to go? Rip Hammer Boy. He's not dead. He's just not on our team right now. Kind of wandering. Oh, it's hard to hear me when I'm far. This looks easy. Hello. Don't get careless. ASMR for your for your thoughts. <laughs> Carol's the dog in the party now? I don't know if that, that's exactly what the answer is. <laughs> You got a new skill. Everyone get your earbuds on for the best ASMR experience. I'm gonna... Uh, what's the word? I won't try to to make anyone's, like, receptors go off by any means, but I will get closer so you guys can hear. Kills the okay. ASMR. Don't get cocky. Yeah, it's just me whispering <laughs> Azure Edge. Oh, 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 You're looking forward to the cry of victory. <sighs> repeat? Down this repeat hype train. I feel like Carol is off fighting his own fight. I don't exactly know what that means, but I'd like to believe that. Alright. I know we're supposed to fight the Rib Guru, but does anyone know where the Rib Guru is? That's the other question. Every character is repeat. There's just like one dude. This looks easy. Don't get careless. Oh. <laughs> 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 the way they were hyping up this river bro. If it's anything like that giant wolf that we saw last time, it'll be good to grind a little bit before we start. <laughs> Like this? Yay! What? I what should go that? back and buy more rice balls. Hey, so oh, me. That's my Estelle impression. It's on the cliff on the left side. Okay. I am going to go back into the city really quick to buy some rice ball ingredients. It's very important. We actually haven't even used the tent yet. We even have oranges. It's lovely. That is. Yeah, thank you guys for uh, just pointing me in the right direction. We can keep this this game running. As much as I love wandering around, it doesn't necessarily make for the best stream content all the time. So I appreciate you guys chiming in. Okay, wait, let's check. Cooking? We can make sorbet. Who would make a nice sorbet? I think Estelle would like it. Maybe Rita. Rita, can you make a sorbet? Or, actually, are we all full? She failed. It's okay. It's okay. I actually am going to... Wait, no. I can't remember... I know that there's like a designated order for stuff. We need rice, seaweed, and salmon. Your girlfriend are playing together. Right now she loves using the next character that joins the party. No spoilers. Alright, no spoilers. Great idea. Lottery gel. Synthesis. Oh 
Oh yeah, I completely forgot about synthesis. Oh, I love that. It's just like gotcha and a gel. that we can synthesize things. It's been a little bit. Orange gel. Just one. We only have one grass. I forgot the word. Melange. Very useful, but rare and limited in numbers. Mmm, interesting. We need 15 gel base for that. We can make attachments here as well. To you know. I completely forgot about this. Oh man, everything looks really fun though. Okay, we're not going to spend all of our time synthesizing and making things right now. Wow, apparently glasses make you a little bit smarter but are definitely a pain to wear during battle. Is it because they'll fall off? Hola, how are you doing? Humble brag, oblivious touch mentions having a girlfriend. <laughs> um, let's see. All right, let's buy. Sorry, we only came here for for rice ball ingredients, but I got sidetracked because I got excited. Now I'm on. Seven. One rice ball for every day of the week. You forgot this is an RPG? RPG intensifies. I mean, would you hurt someone with glasses? She just like takes out my glasses. Come on, guys. Could you? Could you fight me if I looked like this? I always remember to use synthesis, it helps a lot. Yeah, definitely. Alright, I guess I'm just gonna wear my glasses for the rest of this stream. I took the I put these on as a joke, but eyesight is good. Alright. Oh, I like how you can actually definitely see that might be the monster up there. I could be wrong. A little A monster. Man, could you be any weaker? Don't get cocky. You want revenge? Bring it. The glasses are not just for fashion, these are actually prescription, and I do wear them in other uh, streams as well. I, they are shaped a little unconventionally, uh, but they have my prescription in them. Uh, I just don't necessarily need glasses for reading, they're more for distance, so I don't necessarily need to wear them when I'm playing games. That's a lot of information about my personal fashion habits. Please enjoy. Look at that! Fear. This is Ribgaro! I love that it doesn't actually fight sloppy. you until you go to touch it. Alright, equipment. No, not equipment. Items. Weak to... I don't know what any of these type things mean yet. Ribgaro's also the same level of us, which is not great for us. Go for it! Alright. Oh no! Oh, the first thing that happened is that I got this. Nice. No! Repeat! Majestic. Like, I would love to ride it. This isn't over yet. Okay. We must meet with the magistrate. Alright. More important question. 
rice ball time. Hey, I learned something. Hey, we learned a skill. Come on, let's take it back with us. It's covered in scars and bruises. I feel kind of sorry for it. I reckon it's been attacked by desperate townspeople quite a few times. It's not the people in town's fault. No, I understand. Yuri? Oh. The horn is what's so valuable, right? This'll be enough to satisfy that money-grubbing magistrate. Yuri came all this way without knowing how to defend. That's me pressing the X button being like, ah. Don't fight me! Don't fight me! Wow. It's not like you to show pity to a monster. Uh... While you guys are busy talking, the monster's getting up! Bark, bark. What? Why did it run away? Okay. It understood what we were thinking. Poor horsey. Now he's to beat up Mr. Ragoo. The monster I did? Call it Seriously? Mr. Ragoo. Hey, we got the horn. Who cares either way? Alright. Thank you for pointing out where that was. Back to town. It ran away because we all jumped him. But let's work together! Probably, you know, yeah. part of the equation. Resoundo cry of victory! Great ball. Alright. These are the threads that weave our future. I love cooking. Oh, it's the pasta sauce. It's not even the actual pasta. We're gonna fight a guy. Wait! You can't go out again after that girl went through the trouble of healing your wounds! Where are you off to with that dangerous weapon? That's no business of yours. I can't have you sticking your nose into my affairs just because you're curious. Dude, I know that you're going through a lot, but I I've only known you for like 30 seconds. Th this is... Sorry for stealing your thunder back at the inn. Maybe this will make it up to you. Thank, Thank you, you so much. much. Now we can't talk to him. Uh, hold on! You're just giving it to them? Yeah. It's a small price to pay if it saves their child's life. You were planning on doing this from the beginning, weren't you? Mm -hmm. Nope. It just came to me. Sure. You do realize that you just gave away our gift for the magistrate, right? Now what do we do? We fight No him. worries. We'll just find some other way to get into the magistrate's place. Shall we see how Flynn's doing then? Yeah! Maybe he's even gotten into Rago's palace already and set things straight! Yeah, that sure would be nice. Let's go pay a visit to the inn. Alright. Let's go in. Let's go in. Here is an anti-hero we all deserve. He's not even that much of an anti-hero. He keeps doing heroic things all kindly and then being like, huh? Whoops, I guess I was nice. We break the law. That's what we do. It's the name of Brave's Hesperia. That's our guilt. You're looking chipper as always, Flynn. Wow. I've got a lot on my mind, Yuri. Not that you'd know what that's like. Wow. <laughs> Managed to go out and get your bounty raised even higher? No, we just saved a poor family. I thought you went to the Magistrate's place. I went, along with a search warrant from the Blastia Research Lab. 
Ah, so you were able to go inside and look around. No. The Magistrate refused us entry. Why? You're the hero pretending to be an anti-hero. I like that more. He even tried to provoke us. If you really think I have Blastia, try to bust your way in, he said. I feel like this character is voiced by the same person who voices Carol and just goes like a little bit more in the nose. He knows we don't have the jurisdiction to do that. He's just making a mockery of us. Flynn finds you very sus. Well, isn't he right? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. What did you say? Yuri, whose side are you on? I'm, I'm on whichever side it takes to annoy Flynn. It's not a matter of whose side I'm on. If you think you're right, you should force your way inside. No, it's a trap. Rago wants the Imperial Guard Rigo. to make a mistake so he can use it as an excuse to increase the authority of the Council. If we go in now, he'll hide the evidence and feign innocence. Is Magistrate Rago on the Council as well? Yes. The Imperial Knights and the Council are both essential organizations that support the Empire, but Rago seems to have forgotten this fact. So in short, we're not dealing with your everyday Magistrate here. Well, have you got a plan for what you're doing next? <sighs> What, you're out of ideas? If there were some sort of disturbance inside the palace, the Imperial Knights would be able to move in under the pretense of emergency prerogative. Ah, yes. The Imperial Knights may employ emergency prerogative to intervene in emergency situations, regardless of jurisdiction. Thank you, Encyclopedia Estelle. Of course. So if a thief snuck in and caused a ruckus, that'd be enough? Mm. Yuri, I know you want to help. But I shouldn't do anything reckless, right? I've just received a tip that a fugitive with a warrant out for his arrest is trying to get into the Magistrate's palace. Flynn's out of ideas trying to break in. Don't be foolish. I had no choice but to ask you for your help. Please. Don't think you can talk that way just because I'm a council- just because you're a council member. Do you know who I am? No, pardon me. Okay. Yeah, Flynn really tries to stick the law to the letter, and Yuri's like, mm, mm. But how about we don't? He's right. Alright. Uh, it is currently 5.30. We have about, um, half an hour until we wrap up the stream for the night. So I'm going to return, or to take, repeat back out again. This is just going to be a recurring bit. Here he is, unveiled to the world. I think the, the green is getting keyed out by the green screen. <laughs> um, yeah, I do have a green screen up into another green background, but so it's like we're in the skits. Anyway. What's the name of Flynn's voice actor? He's a really cool voice. You play the game usually with a J Japanese dub. That's a good question. I actually don't know off the top of my head. But Honestly, somebody in chat might, so feel free to chime in. Alright, so we do have... Repeat has a nice, like, super high quality chain, like, necklace, I would call it. Uh, it's real heavy, too. So... It has, like, a very good heft to it. Uh, and this is our instructional stream here. That if you would like to place this around Repeat's neck, you do have to be very careful in uh, lifting up his tail, because because the material is so. I want to say like, I want to say it's fragile. It's like pretty sturdy, but also it might be a little. Um, what's the word? Riddle. I think that's it. Um, so you just want to make sure that you're careful when you place the the necklace on repeat. Otherwise, you might hurt him. There we go. So you just place that super cool chain on him. And now he is cosplay ready. He is fit for the world and I took out the took out the pipe again. Oh, it's Sam Regal, that's great. Yeah, double green, green background on a green screen. I just you gotta commit to the accuracy, you know? I just want to give this as a warning to anybody who would who, uh, like to purchase Repeat. This figure um, is a bit... 
I wouldn't say fragile, but it is a bit brittle uh, if you don't handle it carefully. So, let me show that. Check this out. Look at that good boy. I just want everyone to acknowledge he's a very good boy. And I think if I do this. Wait. Status. This is important. This is for the lore. Yeah! Check him out. Repeat's a good boy. And we, we uh, taken away some of the time from the live stream just to point that out. Check out that good boy. And the, the painting on this is like immaculate. I believe they're all hand painted, so. Please check it out on the live stream store if you haven't already and stick around and you could be the lucky winner, so. Being a good boy, repeat. Except I guess there's no dog paw emoji. Back to the stream. I just wanted to show that to you guys. This place seems to get bigger every time I look at it. Are members of the council really that important? Bow down to Master Repeat. The council is a body of nobles which aids in the political administration of the Empire. Which means they basically represent the Empire's interests. Huh. You don't say. Hmm. Carol is learning about politics today. Hi! Hi to Javier who just joined the chat. So what about getting inside? Shall we see if there's a back entrance? Tough luck. Place is surrounded by a wall and there's no getting inside unless you can clear it. You won't last long if you go screaming in a spot like this, your ladyship. I'm sorry, but who are you? What do you mean? Me and the kid there are old friends, right, pal? <laughs> it's like, who are you? What are you looking at? I barely know this guy. Now, now, don't be like that. What about the fun times we had in jail, Mr. Yuri Lowell? <laughs> what about the fun times we had in jail? Remember those? Remember those days we were in jail? You know, I actually do, but um, I'll plug those after the stream. Uh, right now, it's time for Tales of Vesperia. Huh? I don't remember telling you my name. Fun times. In jail? See? You're a celebrity, Yuri. So what's your name, mister? Huh? Ah, right. I suppose Raven will do for now. For now, huh? Who the hell does this guy think he is? Yuri's like, who? I've never done any crimes. Well, Raven, it's been lovely seeing you again. Now buzz off. Aw, oh, come on. You're trying to get into the palace, right? You just leave it up to old Raven. Shouldn't we stop him? Actually, he pulled a trick like this that helped me get out of the castle. Really? Well, then maybe we can trust him. <laughs> 10 out of 10, room service in jail. In all caps, criminal. Well, I'd like honestly, to hope I trust so. the criminals in this game more than I trust the, the law. Gotta trust anyone uh, with old They're bones. coming over here. But that but backflip. Why? Wait till I get my hands on him! No one uses me as a diversion! Explosion. There she goes again with the magic! Now what? Now we go inside, what else? We just got rid of the guards and all. No old bones at all. I wish I could do Whoa, a Whoa, not the front door. Let's see if we can get in from the side. What a cool flip. Yeah, I wish I could do a flip. The stream incentive. Hey, hey, so we flip. meet again. Glad to see you're okay. Catch you later. Wait. Uh, it's going down? An elevator.
Never show repeat. Repeat, repeat is repeat. There's no need no, for No, I don't believe this. Review. You can't control it from down here. Ugh. Something smells rank. Rank. Blood, along with something else? It smells rotten. Repeat does not look real happy about the situation. I wonder if he's into raising monsters, too. Could be. He had Ribgaro, after all. Uh, 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 help me! Uh, what was that? What is this place? Oh, thank you, CP and or Sam, for dropping my personal link in there. It sounds like someone's there. Let's go. Hey, you! Bring that raven creep to me right now! Huh? Why do I have to do that? You're friends with him, right? I told you I hardly know the guy. Oh, really? You met him in jail, right? That's pretty shady if you ask me. I can't really argue with that. I think he's kind of strange, but he didn't seem bad to me. I don't think he's all that good either. <laughs> Look at this wolf just bobbing to the music. Fight me. Yeah, I beat you into next week. Next week? Alright, guys. But can you really? Rice ball. Never we mind. failed the rice ball. <laughs> no. Any criminal is Yuri's friend by default. I kind of love that. Boop. Nope. Boop. Right, you? Hi, Mono, how are you doing? Don't get sloppy! Oh, you know what? I don't have a little poison or anything anymore. Holy power, come to me! Yeah. 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 It'll be a hundred years before you can beat me. Yeah, because yeah, you've lived a lot longer, right? You love Repeat. Repeat is getting a lot of love today. What is... Who are you? Just go away! What is that? Black rhino. Is that what rhinos look like? I I guess so. I've never seen a rhino in real life. We're done. Rice ball. Rice ball. Rice ball! You can just punch a monster with such force. Oh, I love this. We're breaking in. Baseball success. <laughs> no, it's the kid. Everything's going to be okay. Can you tell me what happened? Gary, old man, brought me here. Aww. He said it was because Papa and Mama couldn't pay their taxes. Do you think that this is the kid from before? How horrible. All of these bones. Could the monsters have done this? 
Papa, Mama, I want to go home. It's okay. Everything's okay now. What's your name? Teagle Jr. Holly? Holly. Taxes. Come on, Polly. Be a big boy. No more crying. You'll see your mom and dad soon. Okay. We gave your mom and dad like a bajillion dollars. Hi, Victor. How are you doing? Oop. I missed. I got ambushed. <laughs> This isn't that much of a surprise, was it? Alright, who's next? Get out of here! Photon! Photon's such a cool attack, look at that. Dragon Upper! Get out of here! You want revenge? Bring it! Nah, we failed the rice ball again, guys. That might have been our last rice ball. Treasure chest. An orange gel. Right. Watch us get totally lost down here. Oh, double and I feel like an easy win. Don't get careless. Got a small key. What door does it open? Oh, maybe I should have like pulled open a map of this place or something. Yes, we can do this. I hate it when they fly because it kind of really annoying. I'm not actually at the level. I did buy like seven rice ball ingredients. I thought I only bought four. Cold power. Ooh, ooh. Can we give repeat a cool new sword? Uh, yeah, that's better at physical attack. We lose some defense, so that's a little iffy, but I'll take it for now. But yeah, linking counters can be scary if you're not prepared for them. We got those RPG vibes of trying to get through a dungeon. No, nobody fight me, I'm tired. New repeat weapon, boy. Oh. The key broke. Was this the right door? Let's find out. Oh, doggy. This looks easy. Don't let him trip you up. Hi, Sarah. Um, you know, I would love to tell you any news that we had, but unfortunately, we don't have anything on the right now. That being said, our yeah, best place I beat you in the next week. Next week? Oh, we're gonna have to write can you guys. really? Would be our social media.
We've got a small wolf key. Picture of a wolf's engraved on it. Engraved? Engrained? Boop. Ha! Ah. Bye. Okay, it doesn't seem like there's anything here. Wolf key, wolf, wolf. Very astute observation from, from Twitch. Nope. I don't feel like fighting anyone right now. Just go away! You want revenge? Bring it! Oh, I feel so powerful! Yeah, I can definitely get behind that. I think the graphics are gorgeous still. Is this the right door? Small key, parentheses, wolf. Awesome, I'm glad that you're up to date with our socials. We will get that news to you as soon as we can. That really is all I can say right now, unfortunately. So I'll save point, guys. That can't be a good sign. <laughs> Well, well, what do we have here? More delicious snacks for my pet, it seems. Did you hear that, guys? He thinks we look delicious. So you're a go. You've got some pretty disgusting hobbies. I'm gonna fight you! Use the sorcerer's ring. Understandable, have a good day. Hobbies? Oh, you must mean my basement. You can tell this guy's evil, because the evil music kicked in. Only someone with my refined sensibilities could understand the pleasure I derive from such things. I'm so messed up, and this is the only thing that makes me feel free. You're just like those senile old fools on the council. They bored me to death and never let me enjoy myself. It's the privilege of my exalted station to dispel such boredom with the help of the common people. You can't mean that's your only reason to do those things. Evil music spoiler alert. Well, I suppose I should go and fetch Ribgaro. We already killed So him. many new toys. He had to put on quite a show. Though you may not live long enough to see it. That might not have been There's no point in searching for Ribgaro. We've already taken care of him. What did you say? Are you deaf? I said we've already taken care of him. You... What have you done to my pet? If you had put a bell on it or something, maybe you wouldn't have lost track of it. Hmm. Ah, well, with a bit more money, I'll soon be able to replace him. Rago, how can you say such things and still call yourself a servant of the Empire? What? You? But that's impossible! <gasps> the drama of it all. S stay back! What do you intend to do? We're gonna kill a dude. Someone! Arrest these intruders! We'll have enemies all over the place if we don't hurry up and finish what we came to do. We're gonna kill a dude! Hold it! What? Don't we need to create an emergency for the knights to respond to? It's still too soon. First, we need some evidence. We've got to find the Blastia that controls the weather. The little boy is just with us? I didn't notice that. He was just there. All right. Guys, it's 5.53. I don't know if we should pursue the rest of this plot line, considering that we don't have that much time. But I'm going, I did just save. I'm going to go run in after that guy. Oh, let's see if there's anything in this room really quick. Very important. Oh. And we still have to do our final giveaway. I will leave that up to our very talented moments. Um, but in the next seven or so minutes, we will pick somebody to receive a repeat figure of their own. Again, unfortunately, it is US and Canada only for this one. Uh, but thank you for sticking around. Time for murder. Time for cliffhanger. Can we sources ring these dudes? Oh, it, it really peeved them off, huh? Let's work together. He was angry. Oops. Just Val. Val. 
I like the idea that like there's all these monsters and people to fight and this one's just named Val. Oh. 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 Let's try again. Oh, I keep doing that. Val. Just a human? Yeah, I beat you into next week. Next week? Have enough to make a sandwich, guys. Never mind. Sandwich. We do have um the previous VODs up on YouTube and Twitch if you would ever like to check those out. Uh in case you can't get enough content. Okay, sure. And yeah, we really appreciate you coming by. Uh, next week might be our last Tales of Vesperia stream, but worry not, because we will have more tales coming soon. Hey, hey, hey. I didn't say you could chase me. I didn't say this. I don't want this. Okay, bye. Ooh. Alright. Oh wait, I forgot this annoyed them. I forgot. I like that he just stops and watches you. <laughs> oh, you, you want a sword? Yeah, there's a cool sword in there. I, I don't need it. I have this machete. Yeah, you want that? Okay. Anyway, fight me. <laughs> Repeat the woof. Don't get my oh, way. I love that that's our uh, call and response. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> That guy's going to right now. Does, does this guy also just have a name? Let's find out. Gilga. Yeah. You weren't the one I thought I was attacking, but... And you. We're really getting a use out of our magic lenses. Sue says, uh, the dude with the cool hat. Sit waters! Get out of here! No! Holy power, come to me! A little test! Take that first aid! Whoa! I can't even pronounce whatever yeah, thing you're Yeah, I beat you into next week. Next week? But can you really? Never mind. Bork. This is great small great sword key. Key owned by mercenary. Great sword key for engraved. Alright, so we are deep in the no, let's say bowels. We are deep in the bowels of this this mysterious area. you have that chest i didn't why didn't you let me win because susa you're trying to kill me all right bye susa just kind of waddle through here <gasps> ah, what a beautiful view <laughs> who's there What are you doing small, over there? Sword? I mean, it can be a great sword even if it's small. I don't think that's the definition of it, but it could be. What does it look like? I'm hanging around enjoying the scenery, maybe. Maybe? Oh yeah? I could have sworn you'd been captured. Um, I think she has been captured, actually. No, I haven't. Look at her go. Shiver me timbers. <laughs> I know you. Um, your name was, uh... Jack! Not even close, ma'am. Who's that? I'm Yuri. What's your name? Patty. Patty, huh? We met in front of the mansion, didn't we? Oh, that's right. You couldn't forget the warmth of my hand and came a-chasing after me. Sure, Patty. Look at that sigh. Hey, Patty. 
Hey, what were you doing here? I'm hunting for treasure. I just love everything about Patty. Treasure? So In a place like this? Well, I guess it wouldn't be odd for that black-hearted geezer to have filched some treasures. So, what do you do, Patty? I'm an adventurer. In any case, it's dangerous for a little girl to wander around a place like this all by herself. She's right. Why don't you come with us? This is canon now. Yuri Jack Criminal Lowell. I like it. I still ain't found no treasure. Maybe it isn't my place to say this, but you sound less like an adventurer and more like a thief. An adventurer is one who always carries the spirit of curiosity and the desire to push into the unknown. So while I may look like a thief, I'm actually nothing of the sort. Whatever you say, Patty. <laughs> it's not like I really care anyway. Well, if you're gonna keep hunting for treasure, I won't stop you. What are you gonna do? Just thinking. Light bulb. It's there probably ain't no treasure left in this mansion anyway. She's saying she'll come with us. Okay, then let's go. <laughs> we have two children now. Let's get this over with. <laughs> <laughs> Whoever's the winner. Repeat is the only grown up here. Yeah, that might be fair. I thought about it for a second. It's like, hey, dude, you, you good? <laughs> All right. Well, hey. <laughs> Fine. It's an ambush. We can oh, still overcome this. I see that we announced the winner, but I am totally in the middle of the battle. I will congratulate whoever it is in just a this time. Seeing some warm congratulations from the chat. Awesome. Congratulations! I'm going to try to find a room where we can... I don't know if we can save, though, or if I'm gonna have to go back. Um, but that's just about to conclude our stream, then. I just want people to stop fighting me. <laughs> Piece of cake! Don't get cocky! Yeah. I guess we are in the middle of a dungeon. So I will leave that to our mod to get a yeah, hopefully... We performed marvelously. All right. I might just pause it in a moment if we can't get out of here. Oh, we got a tiny, tiny dagger key and a whip. Scary. And a nice gel. Hey, hey, no, no fighting, no fighting, I'm leaving. Oh yeah, so for anyone who asked, okay, I think I'm safe in this little middle room. 
For anyone asks, uh, this might be the last Tales of Vesperia stream, but don't worry, this won't be the last Tales of stream for a long time. Uh, we'll definitely be streaming for a while. That being said, uh, this is the second to last for Tales of Vesperia, just because we want to get everyone a nice kind of dabbling of other Tales games. So if you're interested in Tales of Vesperia, make sure to check us out again next week, because it might be the last for a while. Um, and, of course, we might be able to have another giveaway, something cool like this repeat figure that I'm going to show off one more time. I took out the pipe and I put it down somewhere. Just know that there's a pipe here somewhere. <laughs> Check that out. Repeat's looking all dapper as usual. I want to thank everybody who came by to watch the stream. If you would like your own repeat to enjoy and to have fun as your little desk friend, check it out on our our store page. I believe it's bananamcoentstore.com slash livestream. We'll get you right there. And um, our mods will drop it in the chat as well. Needs a dapper hat on that figurine? Look, that is up for you to decide. You can make repeat any little hat that you would desire. Um, but yeah, a very gorgeous figure. Like, and I'm not even just saying this. I was really surprised that I got to have one of these myself. And it's hand painted, and um, he's your friend. Repeat is real, and your friend. So, on that note, I guess I'll sign off and have a good night to everybody who came by and watched. I hope to see you guys again next week, and uh, we'll also be streaming on next Tuesday as well. So, catch us then. See you, everybody! Let's see, let me switch over. All right. Bye bye. Ooh. Um, the date is wrong, by the way. It's March 11th, I think, for next Thursday. Today is March 4th. On that note, have a good night, everybody. Bye.